but put the joint back on. A few good things about Saba. So far, it's uh, I ain't like it at first, but after a few listens, I actually ended up enjoying myself. However, on this recent listen I had, it's kind of more on the eye. Uh, it's a little mellow side. Of course, it's not care for me. No one's saying it was supposed to be that, but depends on what you're looking for, what you're trying to listen to, more hype and introspective tracks. You're not gonna get the hype, but you're gonna get the introspective. He still has his bars, his lyrical talent is still there. However, the production's a little bit different, but not too different. It's just more mellow on this project, which could be a good or a bad thing depending on what kind of listener you are. I do enjoy this album, but I don't see myself going back to this because I don't feel it has that much replay value except for a few tracks. Closing thoughts. My favorite tracks are Come My Way and Still. Only thing about the Come My Way track is Crazy Bones verse sounds a little weird. I don't know if he recorded that somewhere else. I don't know where that's coming from. But other than that, and Smino killed his verse on Still. But pretty much, if I had to give it a rating, y'all, uh, say a medium i just i do my ratings low medium high just what it is medium or like a seven i guess if i had to pick a number but yeah good album not great but it's good i may not want to listen to it afterwards but it all depends on who you are and what you like to hear so yeah it's retro dre saba a few good things quick thoughts review and i'm out of here